everyone. So I treated with oxalic acid vapor uh, about two to three days ago, and it's the second treatment. The first one I did was in November, and today is December 23rd. Um, I should have done them back to back, but I just didn't because of weather and issues like that. So um, we're gonna look at the mic drop and uh, see what we have. So yeah, you can definitely see the dead mites that came out of that treatment. And this is so important. Some hive beetles too. It's been warm. We're about to have another big cold snap, but it's been warm here in Georgia. So I'm probably frustrating these ladies. So I'm not gonna stay long. But just want to peek in these bottom boards. They are not too happy. I'm glad I have on my veil. I'm going to skip the flow hive because it's got a little bit different situation. Well, let's do it. Let's do it. I have to pull this drawer out. Oh yeah, wow. I would say that's a pretty good mite drop. Like I said, it's warm, so they are pretty active right now. Go over here to this single deep. See what they have. It's really not that bad. The mic drop. I'm glad I've decided to treat again, though, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. So I had also just um, added candy boards to every hive. So uh, I usually do that around winter solstice. And I'll put the link to the candy boards that I purchase. Um, and actually there's a recipe to refill those candy boards and I will put that also linked in the description below. So Merry Christmas everyone. I hope this is somewhat helpful. It's, it's really good for me to um, vlog the journey of beekeeping and um, I'm excited for next spring. Merry Christmas!